guys are champions, and you guys are champions in every sense of the word. So, Coach, uh, what are your general thoughts on this win here today, taking home the D1 championship? I got to give Exeter a lot of credit. I mean, they came in as a big underdog, and they went up 4 nothing, and they never went away. They never went away. So, all hats off to Coach Holly, Spencer Clark, um, get your Scott stuff. Holly. Those guys play great. Our team. We battled. You know, you fall blind 4 nothing. we remain calm. I mean, if I had to give a few shout-outs, uh, when you were in a tight game and you get the ball over and over again, JJ, I, I don't know if J.J. Murphy was 100%, but he was probably, maybe he lost one. So 16, 20, I think he was 19 of 20. So when you win, 95 of the face-offs, that's huge. So that was huge. Our defense, we got four in the first quarter, and then we held them to three the rest of the game. It was really two until they got one late. So defensively, we, we played great. Um, Face-offs were key. We can never really go on any. We got a few 3-0 runs. We had two runs. You know, obviously the 3-0 when we answered when we were down four nothing to go five four was huge. But then the um, when we went up uh, eight six, that was that was a critical part of the game. And then we were they retired. They don't play as many guys as us. And it was hot out here. But you know, it was certainly. Um, you know, 20-0 is, is an unbelievable, and you know, when you don't have tight games, our tightest game was six goals, so it was the first time we were in a tight game, but I, I mean, we, you know, we stepped up, seniors, you know, took over that game, it's a, it's an unbelievable senior class, we're going to miss them, you know, they were hit with a lot of challenges, last year would have been the best team we ever had, they didn't have that year, and then they're coming off, they've lost two state championships, um, so this was their first championship, so we had a little bit of pressure on us, so anytime you're 19-0, you know, it was tough. Like you look at Maryland in the national championship, going undefeated. That, that it, it's real. It's real. When you're undefeated, it makes it that much tougher. So I give our guys a lot of credit. And just after everything you guys have been through, the whole COVID, missing out on last year, finishing, it, finishing, finishing off an undefeated season in front of a crowd like this. Oh, just, you know what, what does this mean this, to you? <laughs> this is this is the unbelievable student body. I mean, if you can get a shot at that, I mean, that's just an unbelievable student body. <laughs> I mean. It's just an unbelievable student body from our principal, Jason Strinsky, to our D, Ryan Brown. They wanted us to play. They wanted this. They wanted a sense of normalcy. And you could see how important it is for our team to support, but also for the student body to be out here like this. I mean, hats off to Jeff Collins and the HIA and Corey um, Parker for, from Bedford, the AD, for, for hosting this. I mean, this was a first class event. I mean, to be able to, we won the basketball championship. and. It, it was great you won, but without the without the students there, it just took away from it. But having them there, that was that was awesome. I mean, it was just a it was a great high school event. I mean, now I'm gonna really enjoy it because I didn't really have too much time to enjoy that during the game at all. So boys, uh, winning the D1 championship after this crazy year in front of a crowd like that, what's this moment like for you guys right now? It's everything. Yes, it's, it's really amazing to see everything in the past few months come together. Um, I mean, it's it's we had a tough road and we just battled out all year and it feels great. You know, we've been we've been practicing for this moment since the beginning of the season and to to fight off COVID, our team didn't get shut down once and that's a huge shout out to all the guys, all all 48 of them, even even the ones in the stands, they deserve it too, just as much as us. We all did our part and it worked out and we came on came out on top.